for coming, wizard. Subterranean sanitation operations reports there's some kind of problem in the drains. I offered to check it out myself, but the sanitation boss claims that you are the only topsider he trusts to handle the matter. Will you help? Great! The boss is right below us waiting for you. You can use that manhole right there. Good luck! Ah, salutations, wizard. Or is it Scion of Barbaby now? Irregardless, I am most grateful that you have come in this, our hour of need. As you may know, we insects of the subterranean sanitation operations have used the drains to process topsider garbage for generations. Normally, we have no problem dealing with all manner of foul refuse. However, these are not normal times. At present, the trash is revolting. And I do not mean that the trash is malodorous. I mean, the trash has developed sentience, organized, and taken over the dump in a violent coup. Please, Saya, go conversate with the dump foreman and devise a plan to quash this trash monster rebellion before it spills over to Wizard City. No offense, but you as topside is a terrifying to look at. You must be the infamous Scion of Bartleby. <laughs> Glad you're here. The boss says your Scionical Razmataz is our best hope. First things first, we gotta figure out what's bringing the trash to life. If you preoccupy the trash monsters with some of that fancy spell slinging you do, I'll sneak around and see if I can find the root cause. While you had them distracted, I was able to identify the cause of this refuse rebellion. Go! <laughs> or should I say, magical goo. There's a trickle of the enchanted goo coming out of that pipe over there. Whoever is responsible for this could still be on the other end. You's gonna have to climb up the pipe and confront the source of the goo. Then we can figure out what to do with the remaining trash monsters. Wizard, mind giving us a hand, please? Oh, thank you. Wait, aren't you <gasps> Bartleby Scion? Oh, awesome. Please, Scion, you got. Stop! Run away! Go find help! Wait, you're... you! Please, mighty Scion, help us clean up this mess! Thank you so 
much! I hate to ask more of you, but we've really messed up! Please, Sion, you have to help us! This is all my fault! Well, I guess technically starting an unauthorized alchemy club was my sin's fault, but whatever. When Professor Hargrove became suspicious we'd started a club, I panicked and poured all of our alchemy experiments down into the drains. We were just having one last meeting to formally disband. Honest! But before we could adjourn, trash monsters crawled out of the pipes! We tried to reverse the spell, but that just congealed them into one hideous trash king! It chased my friends that way! Please, help them! Oh, please, you're answering this. We know it was a mistake to practice alchemy without proper supervision, but ever since Madame Dark Kettle... No, fool! Your mistake was your wastefulness! You spend your lives on a wanton quest for stuff, only to toss it all aside for something shinier. You even blithely throw away your own creations if they don't suit you. No, you and all of Wizard City will suffer the wrath of the discarded. Ah, we're so sorry for being wasteful, oh pungent one. And we're really sorry we created you. Please don't hurt us. Is that? Holy crow! It's Bartleby Scion! What are you doing here? Oh my goodness. D did you come to join the Alchemy Club? Silence! Your king did not come here to banter. I am here to throw you out! Thank you so much. Um, do you think we could photoman's a quick selfie? Your heroics make it even harder to break it to you that we've decided to disband the Alchemy Club. I'm so sorry, your scionness. I think they'll live, my sin. More importantly, we need to get the book back to the library before important people start connecting dots. Uh, we stole an alchemy book? Not a connect the dots book, you goof. Ugh. Um, you've already done so much, but could you please return this alchemy book to the library? If we're caught with it, we'll be expelled. It goes in the forbidden magic section. Argusson will show you where. Wait, don't ask him. You'll figure it out. You're the scion. <laughs> Thanks. I, I don't get it. it. It should be right here. I'm gonna be in so much trouble. Oh, hello! You're... you! I could really use your help, Scion! I wish I could have had the pleasure of teaching you, but a wizard like you didn't exactly have time to take a history of magic class, did you? <laughs> I tell you, kids today aren't like you were. I suspect some of my students stole the alchemy volume of the Encyclopedia Banned Magicka set. Wait, what? You have the book? <sighs> I'd lose my job if something bad had happened. What's that you say? Trash monsters in the dump? Oh dear. We better take care of this before word gets to Headmaster Ambrose. Let me jot down an incantation and meet you in the dump. Isn't this place fantastic? Dumps are a literal treasure trove of cultural information for history buffs like me. But there'll be plenty of time for me to dig around here later. 
Let's clean up this goo before more of those trash monsters pop up. This incantation should dispel the alchemical magic of the goo, but I'll still need your wizard powers to activate it. When you're ready, stand over there near the trough and focus all your energy on my words. Quellum Varna Osi, Quellum Varna Isi, Kona Buragata, Yuza Elboa's I Greasy! It worked! Hey, the goo is gone! Me and the boys should be able to sweep up the rest of these trash monsters, no problem. Oh, but looky there. Hey, your magic -y mumbo jumbo put a crack in the wall. The boss ain't gonna be happy about this. So, um, perhaps we can fix it. Wizard, light masonry is part of your scion bag of tricks, right? Phew, fix that wall. Oh no! Um, it's okay. Nobody panic. Renee Wolfton is a friend of mine. She'll help us. Wait a minute. Is that a a hallway? We must investigate. Great galloping Grizzleheimers! We've discovered a door. This door is ancient. Beyond ancient. At a glance, I'd say it predates Wizard City. Maybe even Merle Ambrose himself. I've always believed there were other peoples in Ravenwood before the school was built, but I've never seen evidence until now. Wizard, this is as much your discovery as mine. Shall we descend into the unknown together? <laughs> Fascinating! Beneath the drains, there seems to be catacombs. How intriguingly morbid! G -g -g ghosts It's okay, it's okay! I don't think they've seen us. Calm down, wizard! We'll be fine! Just breathe deep and evaluate. How odd! These fellows appear to be from Dragonspire. But there's no historical record of Dragonspire visiting Ravenwood. I wonder... Oh dear me, that ghost looked this way. It looked right at me, right through me, with menace in its eyes. Fight it, fight it! I'll just go hide. Okay, okay, okay. Breathe, Hargrove, breathe. Remember what your mother said. Don't feel your emotions. Write them. So... Ah! The wizard is dealing with the frightful Dragonspire ghosts, leaving me ample time to record my findings. For example, I just found this crypt. I'm of two minds on this discovery. I do desperately want to know what historic secrets rest within, but this is also how horror stories start. I wish I knew how they ended, and oh my word, what a startling noise! I dare say if it happened again, I'd drop this note! Troops! Ours is a dark age! Dragonspire suffers from Rydal's plague. Its streets fill with mobs of the unwashed. Our way of life is ending. But we here will not accept that fate. We will not cower before the tyranny of change. We will see Dragonspire, true Dragonspire, preserved. Here in this hidden land, this ancient forest, we will make our stand for our prince, our true king. This will become Dragonspire Reborn! 
But we will not accept this fate. We, we, we will not. No, no, no. You not. No, you don't, don't. You. You don't belong here. Startling noise caused me to drop my previous notebook. It's a good thing I have spares. I'll retrieve the old one on my way out. What has happened here? These gems in the walls, they seem to be Dragonspire knowledge crystals. But they're, uh, misbehaving. These projections, they're not ghosts. They're memories from the crystals, seemingly stuck in a constant loop. Troops! Ours is a dark age! Dragonspire suffers from Rydal's plague, its streets filled with mobs of the unwashed. Our way of life is ending! These knowledge crystals bear further inspection, but I can't do that and write notes at the same time. See you later, notebook! This will become Dragonspire! Stretches on and on. Prince Vigor promised a swift victory against the Three Minders, but his promises have proven. <laughs> Turn not your gaze from the knowledge crystal. You must allow it to peer through the windows of your soul. It is vital we record these events. As warnings, perhaps, as omens to ward away our descendants' and successors, to tell them not to do as we have done. There is no victory to be found here. The spell trees cannot be tamed, and the tree minders wield the elements like a poet wields the pen. Do not let your resolve shatter. The tree minders, they, 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 they. There's one here. They, 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 there. The magic, and that one. It's wrong. It, 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 it's, it's wrong. <laughs> I knowledge, you knowledge crystal record of events, M magic, wrong shatter. It's shatter knowledge crystal. Prince Vigor promised a swift victory against the three minders, but there is no victory to be found. Dragonspire wanes from plague and upheaval, but my lord has enlisted me, me to help save it. The tribulations never end. The fires fall from the sky, the clouds crack with lightning, and even the leaves fly at us like knives. We may lose our kingdom, but we will rebuild it here, in the forests where magic comes from. Our prince will build our world anew. The forests cannot be claimed. The tree minders will the world itself to repel us. We are. We are all dead. We are all dead.
What an honor this is! Dragonspire wanes from plague and upheaval, but my lord has enlisted me, me to help save it! Oh my! As soon as I left that other chamber, a knowledge crystal grew back in the doorway! What's causing them to spread like this? Is it the same thing disrupting the projections? The recordings are all fragmented, blended over many years! And worse, they seem aware. When they become aware that they're aware, they lash out! Uh oh, that one seems aware that I'm aware that it's aware! So now it's aware! And I must away! Stop writing, Hargrove, and hide some! My hiding place, it turns out, was a tunnel. Fortunately, there were no crypt spiders. Dreadful things! Oh, look! Another ghost! A very different kind of ghost, in fact. Perhaps a friendly ghost? He's beckoning me, pointing toward a door. I'll just place this notebook here for safekeeping and go take a look. That way. Greetings, simple tree folk. I am your prince, Vigor. Allow me to welcome you all to the new Empire of Dragonspire. Now, take me to the trees. The talking trees that teach the ways of magic. We have them in my homeland. You gave them to my ancestor. I would see the originals. We have traveled far through violent skyways. I warn you, I did not come to be denied. This forest is mine. Your secrets are mine. You are mine. The trees are not meant for conquest, nor magic for war. Leave in peace, or you, your soldiers, all who trespass, will become compost to feed the tree. The past is hungry. For Prince Vigor, the spell slingers cannot resist us forever! Hold! There is an intrusion. The cycle of memories is broken. What, what trickery is this? You cannot, you can... How long has it been? Why, why can't I remember? There is confusion beyond the cycle of memories. The circle must be reconnected. The loop restored. The intrusion expelled.
Tell me, strange one, what has become of Dragonspire, of my legion? Answer, or you will be supper for my drink. I've told you, I've told you! You're just forgetting! Dragonspire overcame the plague that brought you here! But many years later, your people woke the Fire Titan, and it burned your world to the ground. So Dragonspire did fall, not to plague, not to revolution, but to fire. And here, my forces, my mission, why can I... No! <laughs> this isn't what I said, this isn't what I knew. Deviation from the cycle brings fear, confusion. But I won't submit, not until I know. <laughs> Fancy Mander, you arrived just in time, wizard! And you found my notes? Excellent! This day is looking up! I know I shouldn't have come down here alone, but intellectual curiosity. And when I did, I saw all these fragmented memories, these projections. And then they saw me and chased me down here, where Vigor cornered me. Oh, and there's so much more to tell you. But first, let's go back the way we came to the relative safety of anywhere else. So this is what we have become. Villains, warriors, as violent as those we sought to repel. But at least now, the war is ended. At too great a cost, the trees all burned, and the great oak has turned his gaze from us in shame. And our people flee across the skies, back to the weird wood, to a forest not littered with nightmares. The weird? In Avalon? Oh my, I think I know who these tree miners are, or rather, were. We'll convert the old halls to lay them all to rest, and plant what new trees we can. Then we too shall travel to the weird. Our time here is done. So please, wizard, destroy the knowledge crystal. Let us stop reliving this nightmare. Druids! That's what they were, I think. You can still find a few in Avalon, but I suspect they have little in common with this lot. Not much is known about ancient druids, but it was thought they had a special affinity for magic, for the unseen forces of the spiral. Such as the forces that govern the knowledge crystals of Dragonspire, which is why these druidic tree minders seem more aware of us. It would be exciting if it weren't so horrifying. Quickly now, let's get outside and regroup. Ah, yes, this dark and terrible tunnel is slightly less frightening than that one. Now, wizard, let's review what we've learned. Long ago, a plague on Dragonspire caused a social upheaval. Believing his society doomed, Prince Vigor led a contingent to conquer Ravenwood. It seems he thought the spell trees here would provide him unmatched power, but the druidic inhabitants fought back, and both sides were destroyed. Records of this were contained in knowledge crystals, which are now bleeding out tormented specters who are forced to relive this tragedy. But how did this happen? I suspect Vigor himself is the key. He seems more cognizant than his peers. Whatever caused this must have started with him. So you should venture into the tomb that has his family seal and put these tortured phantoms to rest. I'll... I'll stay here.
age is wrong. I am wrong. I am not Vigor. Am I his memory? Why am I so, uh, so scattered, fragmented? Nothing corrects. You dare pursue me? You child, you wretch, you sticky-fingered waif, grabbing at secrets that are not yours to know? These trees, your trees, were ours by right. The Minders didn't understand. The peasants of Dragonspire didn't understand. You don't understand. Knowledge is a burden. It must be shielded, protected, contained. If not, do you know what results? Plague. A few errant germs. That is all it takes to bring the mightiest warriors coughing and sputtering to their knees. or tree people or children. It is meant for the likes of me. I did not succeed. I tried to keep the knowledge of Dragonspire in the hands of the worthy, the aristocracy. But according to your historian, the peasantry and the rank and file took it for themselves and used it to wake a titan. I tried to create a new dragon spire here, one where the royalty would protect its citizens from the things they cannot know. But I was defeated, and my soldiers are now trapped in the purgatory of that failure. And my punishment, it seems, is to know this, to watch it over and over. Even now, I feel the tug of the crystal pulling me back to my recorded path. I must break its chains, break history's chains. If I am the last record of Prince Vigor, then I will do as he would do. I will fight.
fight like the Tree Minders. The secrets of magic really did reach the masses, didn't they? But why? How can I know this? I am an image stored on a knowledge crystal. I should no more change than a portrait upon the wall. Can you tell me? Can you solve this? Can you put my followers to rest? I feel they pull constantly to the next chamber. I think... I think the cause is there. I see now. This is my crystal. But what is this substance upon it? The last vestige of a failed alchemical formula, you say? A coterie of students created it without permission and dumped it down the drains? Just like Rydal and his plague. The potion must have altered the state of the knowledge crystal, and its effects radiated out to the others. All this madness from an errant spill. If you remove the crystal and clean it off, the others should quiet down over time, and the memories of my army can rest. I have a courtesy to ask, if I may. This crystal holds the last will of the real Prince Vigor. Lay it to rest in his homeland, in Dragonspire. Wizard, you survived! I was just about to send some students in after you! You say Prince Vigor is gone? Wonderful! That means it's safe to investigate the remaining knowledge crystals. Think of all the history. Lost knights, druids, forgotten wars, what else is down here? The mind reels! But it sounds like you have one more task. Bury Vigor's knowledge crystal by the last remaining spell trees of Dragonspire. Come find me again when you're done. The war is costing us much. Victory is not as assured as when we started. If these be my last thoughts, may they make it home. I know our world is changing. I know the people seek the power they feel is being kept from them. And I know which way the wind is blowing. But I also know that only the elite, the royalty, can be trusted with knowledge. Only we can use it well. And I know history will prove me right. It didn't, you know, prove him right. Poor Prince Vigor. So dismissive of the lower classes, he missed a lot when he left. That change he talked about? That was the founding of this academy, where they taught everyone not just about magic, but how to use it right. At least until the generals and kings unleashed the Dragon Titan. But that's ancient history. Come here, wizard. Let's get up on today. So, what have you been doing? Exploring catacombs, huh? Yeah, me? Yeah, I've just been here. I'm always here. Yes, I did know Vigor when he was alive. I've been in Dragonspire a lot longer than he was, ever since I was brought here from the Ravenwood. Three minders. King Kilgore said we were all gifts between two great peoples. Maybe they were the second one. You know, I think that statue was built in honor of the Tree Minder leader. What was his name? Primrose? Ambrosius. Aurelius Ambrosius, I think. But if you want to know more about Reminders, you should go back to the Ravenwood. That's really where they got started. Oh good, you're back, and just in time. While you were taking care of things in Dragonspire, I'm afraid I went off and did some more exploring. 
I just couldn't help myself. These tunnels are so fascinating. Anyway, I discovered the entrance to a new chamber. It was full of amazing carvings. But before I could examine them, there was a tremor, and heaps of bones rose up to attack me. The confounded things took my notes. Without them, I won't be able to translate the carvings. Please, help me retrieve them. See? Look at the horrible things. They are unnatural, even among the undead. Ah, oh, thank you. I really need to take better care of my notes. Now that you're here, you can protect me while I examine these carvings. Hopefully these undead horrors won't give us any more trouble. Look closely at these carvings. Here, I've been able to confirm that they are indeed druidic. But there are some subtle differences between these glyphs and the druidic inscriptions in Avalon and Albion. I think these may be far older. Ancient chronicles claim that the druids came to Albion and Avalon from an ancestral home lost to history. That lost home must be Ravenwood! I must learn more. That door, judging by its carvings, must lead to some kind of special chamber. Perhaps a temple. We must open it. Beware, my scion. A dire danger has arisen here in the deep. Dark forces are at work. Ages ago, when the druids dwelt in the Ravenwood, they imprisoned evils that posed a threat to the spiral. Some of their prisoners have escaped. You must return them to their magical slumber, or the consequences will be grave. I will open the door. You must restore the ancient druid's prison. Beyond this door lies one of the greatest secrets of the ancient druids. So the builders of these tunnels were druids! Remarkable! I will accompany you into the chamber beyond, wizard. Look at this place! How wondrous! There are more carvings in here! We should examine them! I've seen symbols like these in ancient texts! If I'm right, this is a diagram of ley lines! They're a legend among historians! According to some sources, ancient wizards used ley lines to travel between the worlds of the spiral before world doors were invented! These inscriptions here, they say the druids wove the ley lines! They extend along Bartleby's roots, touching every world in the spiral! This proves the theories are true. The ley lines must be how the druids brought their prisoners here. But how did they find them? Where are they? They are still here, most of them. It has been long since any walked in this chamber. When the spiral was young, I began my watch over this place. I am charged to destroy all who trespass, but I sense tree magic in you. Welcome. Ages ago, we crafted the amber orbs, enchanted to imprison the essences of evil things. We kept them here in our hidden prison. The orbs were held aloft, 
Suspended in a web of binding magic, but a great tremor shifted the men here that bound the web, and the orbs fell. I am but a ghost. I cannot shift the stones into place. Write the men here, and the prison will be restored. I ask you in the Great Oak's name. Excellent! Keep going! The Great Prison is restored. Now you must return the orbs to the Great Binding. You have done well, yet this is but a beginning. Three of the Amber Spheres shattered when the wards were broken. Their prisoners have escaped. To my sorrow, I was not strong enough to stop them. The first is a renegade of our order, who sought to become the Great Tree's scion. He failed. Bitterness consumed him, and the evils we fought took root in his soul. He has fled to Avalon. Next is Satharilith, a vile mythborn abomination that devours thoughts and replaces them with its own. It has gone to Valen's land. The last is a horror born in the dark spaces between the worlds. We named it the Devourer. It has fled to the very edge of the spiral. The evil these fiends might unleash is unspeakable. As the Great Oak Scion, it falls to you to stop them. Bring them back, sealed in amber orbs. The next chamber is the heart of our web of ley lines. The prisoners used them to escape into the spiral. Follow them, and do not tarry. So, some trace of the Order still survives. My brethren lacked the courage to destroy me before, and now the Spiral will pay for their folly. Turn back, rootless one. This path leads to your doom. Wait, you are the Great Tree Scion? I have grown far beyond the paltry powers I once sought. I pity you who are now Bartleby's slave. I shall free you from your misery, and then I shall release an eldritch plague that will consume the spiral.
I unleash my spite upon you! My envy burns! Let it burn you! My rage is free! It will destroy you!
return me to an eternity of nothingness, I beg you. What is this? I am pursued. Know this, puny mortal. Once my puppet breaks your will, your mind will be mine to toy with. You are stronger than you seem, but the druids who imprisoned me ages ago were far stronger. How can you hope to stand against me? in hideous danger. You must save them! Still you persist. Admirable. But your doom is sealed. I look forward to consuming your mind and using your power to conquer the spiral.
simple. To turn your powers against you. Simple to turn your powers against you. <laughs> How simple to turn your powers against you. Our mind is our own again. We are in your debt, wizard. Against the mental powers of this creature, all our military might was useless. If only we still had our mindless automaton soldiers to defend us. The prison is restored and the prisoners are returned. Bartleby has chosen a mighty champion. It is time for you to take up the watch we once held. May your roots grow deep and your branches tall. This is positively overwhelming! What we've discovered here will revolutionize our understanding of the history of the Spiral! The secret history of the Druids, confirmation of the existence of ley lines. I could write a dozen books about it all. Tenure, here I come! Oh, and I'll definitely need you to write me in-depth descriptions of all three of the entities you captured. Ten pages each, shall we say? Incredible! So much history discovered in a single chamber. What other secrets could be lying down here, just waiting to be found? Music 